coming to you with another taste test video. Last time we did all of the vegan milks out there, all the plant milks, and today we're doing all of the vegan creamers. And we, we happen to really like the vanilla flavor creamer, so we bought vanilla flavor in any, all the brands that we could find. And the brands that didn't have vanilla creamer, we just obviously just had to get the plain, like the Trader Joe's one and a couple other ones. Again, we do these videos to show that there are so many vegan options out there today. We have 11 different creamers, and I'm sure there's more out there. This isn't all of them. This is just what's by us in New York and a few stores that we went to. I'm sure you can find other ones. So really, there's no reason to drink disgusting, pus-filled, cruel um, cow's the milk. Yeah. The Ditch the cow's milk and go for a plant milk yes. or for dinner. And if you're new to my channel, welcome. I'm the Veggie Nut. This is my husband, Eddie. We also have a vlog channel. I'll leave that link down below. And on this channel, we do I do all kinds of vegan-related videos. I do taste tests, reviews, um, recipes, what I ate in a day videos, shopping hauls, and I also talk about weight loss and natural healing with whole plant foods and all kinds of stuff. So if you're interested in that, hit the subscribe button so you don't miss any videos. I'm also representing, I got Team Broccoli shirt on, Broccoli Babe. Broccoli is my favorite. I eat it pretty much every single day. And if you're interested in one of these shirts, I'll leave a link down below. And let's get started. Is there? I guess we'll start with this side. And this is the Califia. Uh, the Califia. I believe that's how you say it. And we were able to get French vanilla in this flavor. Take a sip. And we're drinking this in Tecachino coffee. That was pretty good. It's all right, it's okay. It's, you know, a little bit watery. Yeah. Uh, not that, you know, thick. This one is the Trader Joe's original coconut creamer. I'm not a big coconut creamer fan, just to put that out there, with coconut milk or anything. Some people love it. I prefer yeah. soy and then almond milk. This is good for a plain creamer. It doesn't have that much of a coconut taste, actually. That's good. It's pretty mild. It's not mm -hmm. bad. Yeah. It's pretty mild. That's pretty good. The coconut isn't overpowering, so yeah. we're gonna go through these and then we'll tell you, like, you know, we'll rate them afterwards. This one is the Trader Joe's soy creamer. Original. Mm. Now I like this one better than the coconut creamer. That one's a really good one if you're just looking for a plain, like, half and half type. It's very good. Creamer. Yeah, it's got, mm. like, a real good taste. And it, and we've, we've bought that in the past. We, we like to drink this with tea. Yeah, it's very good yeah. with tea. It's very neutral flavor. Yeah. Next is the Ripple. It is supposed to be, like, a half and half, and we got a vanilla flavor. Doesn't have much of a vanilla flavor at all. This is the first time that we saw this one in the store. We got it yeah, at Whole Foods. Vanilla flavor. It says it's vanilla flavored, but I don't really taste much vanilla. It's not bad though. It's pretty creamy though. Yeah. I'll give it that. It's got a nice creaminess. It's too. very creamy. And they also had a plain flavor, but I'm wondering what that would be like. Yeah, it's pretty creamy. Yeah. It's a, a, like you say you wanted to add a little bit of sugar or yeah. something to your coffee, you know, that would probably be pretty mm -hmm. nice. It gives it a nice thickness. Not much vanilla flavor, not very sweet. So, uh, yeah. It's rich. It's rich though. Next is, this is the one that we always buy. Um, we've tried many of these in the past, but never side by side, and we haven't tried all of them. But we always go back to the Organic Valley Soy Creamer and French Vanilla. This one just has been our favorite. It has the most flavor, very creamy. Yeah. So I'm wondering how we're gonna like it against yeah. all the other ones. Yeah. Yeah, that one's just so good. Good vanilla flavor, has good a bit flavor, of uh, sweetness. Good texture. Um, very thick, creamy, very good. They did it right. And the sad thing is that's the same company that makes yeah. you know, Organic Valley milk and yet they, they've nailed yeah. the like non-vegan creamer. Yeah, it's weird. Yeah. A lot of the vegan companies don't have it down as good, but the dairy company does. Next is the Soy Delicious Coconut Milk Creamer. Did I say Soy Delicious? So, so delicious. So delicious. So delicious in our Darth Vader mug. That one's good, but it has, uh, it has a good vanilla flavor, but it also has a kind of strong coconut flavor. 
Yeah, not bad. It's got a really good vanilla flavor and does have a good flavor. But yeah, it's it has little, that like a, chalky. Yeah, a little, flavor. little, and a, and little a little thinner, a little more yeah. watery. Mm. What's it's up next? Silk, um, next. The silk, silk soy vanilla. Okay. Now years ago, I used to like this one a real lot. Mm. Until I, until I try, and then I've discovered some other ones that I don't like it as much. It's so good, good vanilla flavor, so, yeah. good creamer. I find that soy makes the best creamers, in my opinion, because it's more thick and rich. Yeah, it's, it's rich, yeah. So far, that's my second favorite. And what happens is when you flavor it with something a little bit, it doesn't taste like I know people, I know people say that that soy taste, like the bean taste, but it has like, like the bean taste. I guess if you if you made any bean into a milk, mm -hmm. but with that, you don't even taste it. You just taste no. the thickness. It's very delicious. It's creamy. Even with this one. Yeah. And you know what's funny? Like with almond, almond milk and stuff, almond milk's good, and almond milk makes really good creamy ice cream, but for creamer, it's not as thick. Yeah. It's just Weird. more watery. Yeah. All right, well, next guess... is the Natural Bliss, and this is by Coffee Mate. Mate, and you know, they're another company that has just, um, dairy products but now they have almond milk creamer and coconut creamer and I think that's it. Yeah. Uh, they have different flavors. We got vanilla. But it's weird. I like the soy creamers better but it has just like a regular milk to put in stuff. I like almond milk better. That one's good too. That one's pretty good. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It has a strong vanilla flavor and sweetness. I like when it has a bit of sweetness, you know. Oh, yeah, who, who doesn't like coffee that's sweet? Don't. Well, some people that don't have sugar in their coffee. Like my mom likes to have no sugar in her coffee, mm -hmm. so. I think what it is is the real, real, like, coffee lovers mm -hmm. don't care if it's sweet. Yeah, they'll drink but, it. But the rest of the world that, like, drinks coffee, like most people do, because it smells good or because they want, like, a little boost in the morning or whatever, mm -hmm. um, I drink it because it smells good. I love the way it tastes, but well, I think too. that the sugar enhances it it well, well, the taste. Sugar makes it yeah. good. It does. <laughs> All right, next, we're trying to move along fast because usually our videos are very long. This is the Nut Pods. Now, with this one, I um, only found this online. I got it from Amazon. I'll have the link down below. So, this is Nut Pods, and I got it in French vanilla, unsweetened, and I've never seen this in the stores. Here you go, my dear. Thank you. Plain. That one is because um, it's unsweetened. The texture, it gives a decent texture to it. It doesn't really have a nutty, a little bit of a nutty flavor, but not much. But because of the lack of sweetness, yeah. it's like it's just like drinking like water. Yeah. I, again, I wouldn't say it's uh, very vanilla-y, vanilla -y, is that no. a word, yeah. or sweet. So yeah. if you're looking for more of a milk or creamer, yeah. like half and half, that would be good. Yeah, because yeah, this has no sugar, so yeah. you can add a pinch of sugar to it if you like. Or if you don't like sugar, yeah. that would be good for you. Exactly. And last is this one by So Delicious Coffee Creamer. I don't like that one. Yeah, it tastes like crap. And that one, when you look at it, it, it separates, like it becomes all weird in the creamer, and it's just, it has a really weird texture, and Not a um, fan. yeah, it becomes all weird, and um, I don't know, it, it's kind of nauseating. I don't like it. Yeah. So that would be my least favorite. Yeah. Last but not least. Oh! I, that's all right. I caught you, see? That, that's, yeah. that's why I'm a good anchor man. That's what was going on. I saw you later. Yeah, it's, right, it's right, right in front of us, yeah. Now, this one I also ordered online, but I then we did see it in a health food store after. This is, uh, do you say that, Laird's? Laird, I guess. Laird's. Laird, yeah. Superfood. And they did have the original flavor, plain, but when I saw turmeric, if you know me, Come on, turmeric. I had to get turmeric flavored creamer. Um, go one or two ways. Could be good. Or absolutely disgusting. Um, I have not met a turmeric flavored thing that I don't like, so I'm sure I'll like it. Turmeric is interesting. I don't know how it'll be in coffee, but you know, it's unique, and I like it. Most people will not like that. Just say, put it out there. But the texture is good, and this is really good too because it's powder. You could bring it with you. Okay. You know. Hmm. Actually. Yeah. It's rather interesting. That it's would be really good in tea, too. 
better mm. tea. Mm. Yeah. That's a little thinner. Yeah. So it'd be good like a it's nice got, like herba mate tea. You but know? yeah, but it's it's got a nice taste. It's mm -hmm. nice. Plus, I mean, it's got some turmeric in it, so at yeah. least it's got good anti-inflammatory. Yeah. If you are a fan of turmeric, I really recommend trying out the turmeric flavor. And if not, then you could get the original. And this is great for uh, vegans or people avoiding dairy when you're traveling because you don't have to refrigerate it. Oh, and it also says this is good for smoothies and bacon and other things too. Mm. So my opinion is, I, we know we love this. Organic Valley soy creamer. This is the one that I'm gonna, we're gonna continue to buy again yeah, and again. It's my favorite. It's my favorite. Actually, second favorite is now this because I love turmeric and it's powder. It's, you know, convenient and you don't have to worry about it going bad so I really like that. Now we're gonna rate them. First up, the Califia Almond Creamer. I'm gonna give this, I might be a little bit harsh with the creamers because I'm really picky, but I'm gonna give this a seven. That's exactly what I was gonna do, no shit. I think it's, yeah. yeah, it's good. Like I would buy that again, but it's yeah. not my favorite. The Trader Joe's Coconut Creamer, again, I'd give it a six. Yeah, that's fair. Trader Joe's soy creamer, I'd give it an eight or nine. Yeah, I'd give it like an eight and a half, nine. It's yeah. good. It's got a real For good For a plain, no flavor creamer, like a half and half. Next, the Ripple. Um, I think it's really good. I'd give it an eight. I'd give for it texture. For texture and taste, but I would give it a nine if it actually tasted more like vanilla. But I bet you if you use the regular one, mm -hmm. it'd be a nine because it's yeah. got the creaminess to it. Yeah, if you get the plain one and you're not expecting vanilla, it would be really good. The Organic Valley Soy Creamer, 10. Yeah, 10, 10, 10. Best creamer, it is. so it's just good. Awesome. Really, like if you want a flavorful, like really creamy. You're a vanilla person, you so like, good. it's just so good. And it's not, it's not, it's not too much sugar or anything, mm -hmm. and it's really good. So delicious, coconut milk creamer. I'd give it a six. He's gonna just agree with no, me. No, no, so far, everyone you've guessed on. Yeah, we don't, we have pretty similar tastes. Everyone taste, you've guessed yeah. on been the same, I was gonna say a six. We, we have a similar taste, so. We're like two peas in a pod. Peas and carrots. Next, the silk soy creamer in the vanilla flavor, I'll give this an eight. It's good. If yeah. you can't get the organic value, the yeah. silk is really good. Yeah. Actually, I like a lot of silk products, and I like that silk does so much promoting for the products. Yeah, it's just, it's really good, but did I give, the, I give this a seven? Yeah, that one's like it's a step up for that. Yeah. Okay, and the Coffee Mate Natural Bliss Almond Milk Creamer, um, seven and a half. That's not say seven and a half, eight. Seven and a half. <clears throat> I'd say this, I like the silk better, so. Me too. Okay. That one's a little sweeter, but the silk is better. The Nature's <laughs> Dairy Free Creamer Nut Pods, I'd give this one a six. Yeah. You were gonna, I was say, gonna seven. say six to seven. Yeah, depends you because see, just drinking it like that, mm. it's like eh. Again, I like my coffee to be a little sweet, so I'd have to try it with a little bit of sugar and see how it fared. Mm. And I give a zero. <laughs> the so delicious, it's coconut milk coffee creamer barista style French vanilla. Um, I do not like this at all. Uh, I don't know if it was bad. I think I tried this years ago. I didn't like it either. Um, a three. Yeah. And that's being nice. Yeah. Maybe if you um, if froth you it. Froth it. Maybe it's gonna be froth. Maybe that's why it was separating because you have to froth it. Maybe. Maybe. So I. So we, we could be a bunch of idiots and just yeah. not do it. But right. I'm sorry, but we're two lazy people that are not willing to froth yeah. our cream. No. So so this would not be for us. If that's for you, maybe this will be uh, really away. good. Froth away. And last but not least is the Laird's. Superfood turmeric creamer. Sounds I don't know if I'm saying that right, so you forgive guess. me. You pick it. Um, I'm gonna give this. <laughs> You're saying it. No, eight. no, I'm, I'm doing about you looking. I'm just yeah. doing it so, so he, you can't He's say putting it. his fingers down because I was saying he was copying me. He says eight. I'm gonna say nine. Yeah. So I give this a nine. It's good. Especially though. the fact that it's turmeric. You well, know, it's a good way to add it into many things. Yes. So. I'll give it an extra for that. I'm just gonna say. And that it Plus, doesn't and, have to and, be refrigerated. And it's portable. That's yeah. beautiful. I mean, if you're gonna go, if you're someone that travels a lot. Yeah. It's yeah. great. Even if you don't bring the whole thing, with you can put it in a bag and seal it yeah. up. You know. It, it's, it's not. Good. It's not really creamy, but no. it has a good flavor. Well, we're gonna be drinking a lot of coffee and tea. 
Okay. Yeah. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you like taste test videos, let me know down below what you would like to see next. And if you've tried any of these, I'm curious as to what's your favorite and what you're looking forward to trying now. And that's it. We'll see you next see time. Bye. See ya.